Okay, so I'll be using these first because they look like these two O's and these 0.5, 0.25s, um, all black. Then the last one is these. They are 0.30, like I said before. They are aluminum as well, so quite dangerous compared to these three, but I'm going to test it in the chronograph, see what I get. We'll do three shots of each caliber, I mean each um, size, and see what I get. Loaded. All right, so I had to do a few tests off camera, but um, this is what I'm getting with point, um, point twelves. I had to hop up adjust it to low, I think, so it was like give me less FPS. I forgot how that really works out, but I'm gonna do my three shots again. All right, fine. I'm gonna do it again. Okay, so this was the uh, last shot from 11 to 13. These are the shots. Uh, 11 is 388, then 388 again, then 387. These were the before shots. Uh, the highest I got was 380, 390.1. Then before that was 277, which is really low. All right, so I got the little point two wells in there. I wanna redo the settings on the chronograph. Okay. Already got the man loaded up. Now I gotta do a shoot. Shoot three. Okay, that was easy. Okay, let's see if I can zoom or focus. First shot was 303, second shot was 306, and last shot was 304, which is what I expect on the um, AK. It doesn't have the best air seal um, because of the nozzle or whatever, it don't have no O-rings. I'll get one of those later, but that's what I'm getting from those. Now I'm gonna switch to the black 0.25 gram BBs. Okay, I got the 0.25s in there. Okay, I'm getting, I think the 270s, yeah, pretty consistent. Uh, first shot was 273.4, next shot was 272.1, last shot was 273.2. Last thing, I'm gonna do the aluminum BBs. I'm gonna just do the settings right now. Everything on this gun is um, stock, same spring it came with. Okay, got it set up. Now I'm gonna change the ammo. Aluminum. Okay, I'm gonna definitely pick those up once I'm um, done with this. But um, very low now. It's um, shooting. First one was 244.9. Next one was 248. Point four and last one was 246.2 which is a big difference from when it started out at 
three to going all the way down to two forty seven and six. So that's a big difference from point twelve to point thirty. It probably would have got to a hundred if um I had the sniper rounds that are like point four six or higher. It would have really been lower. I think on the box of the gun it said that it was shooting about 400 no 500 fps with 0.12 but i never achieved that so it was most likely a lie but um the spring they had in there is what i have in my p90 as well and that has great air compression and it's shooting at 389 with um 0.20 gram bbs it's probably like 450 with uh 0.12 which i want to try that later as well that's pretty much that's pretty much on an AK, and I am gonna do some mods to this. Um, I might not make this a DSG, but I'm gonna uh, get a 28 TPA motor, 13 to ones, and just get it to somewhere faster and just a faster trigger response because it's really low. This is what it sounds like, which is still good for a stock gun, but uh, I just wanna get it better. And as well with the P90 as well.